back to my channel and on today's video I wanted to keep it a little more casual um, so this is my living room I mean my dining table or dining room <laughs> so anyways and this is my baby bump I decided to do it indoors this time I usually do it outside but hey guys welcome back to my channel I just finished filming the question and answer video I did not change my outfit because I didn't feel like it. it's too hot. <laughs> Alright, so on today's video, I want to show... Oh, oh my god. This, this is weird. Okay. On today's video, I want to talk about my 16 and 17 week pregnancy update. I'm going to include some... I'm going to include some pictures and some videos, little clips of what my two past weeks has, have been about. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, and let's get started. Okay, so let's start with week 16. Uh, week 16, I had a lot of energy. I did um, my backyard work. Like, I took all the, like, weaves out of the backyard. Um, and I also did the front yard. I had a lot of energy. I did a lot of cleaning of my house. I don't know if you saw that on my snapshot, but I did clean my makeup room as well. Um, but it doesn't look clean anymore <laughs> because I've been, like, you know, just moving things around. So I did the cleaning for... The whole house. I'm working on the garage and the kiddos' rooms because I just want to have everything clean. I have this obsession with cleaning, cleaning, cleaning. So my week 16 and right now, <laughs> I have still been clean. The 4th of July, which it was my 16th week, I was I woke up, I was in Rosa's bed, and for the first time ever, legitly, <laughs> I legit, legitly, I don't know if that's even a word, but... I felt the baby kick like super like strong and solid and I thought it was the cutest thing ever so that was, it legitly kicked me so I was like oh my god I can't believe it that is so crazy I officially felt the baby kick um so my cravings for week 16 and 17 have to be nacho cheese just like regular nachos with cheese on top and jalapenos well if it has jalapenos it's a plus but if it doesn't, I will still eat them and they're so yummy. Um, so yeah, that's one of the things that I crave. Like, you know, like when you go to the movie theater. Yesterday we went to the movies and um, I got some nachos with cheese and it was so yummy. So yeah, this, something about the cheese right now that I'm loving. My husband's like, oh my god, you're going to give the baby diabetes. <laughs> so I don't know. Cheese is like... A thing of mine. Also donuts, uh, chocolate donuts, those are the things that I'm craving the most. 17, I have been, I think the last three days, I have been feeling very sick. I don't know if it has to do with my thyroid. Um, I did run out of medicine a couple days ago, so I did get my new ones. And I wasn't taking my medicine for, I would say, probably two days. So what happens if I don't take my medicine for two days, I start feeling, well, I feel good. But when I take the medicine, I kind of like go down, like poof, hit the ground. And I feel very tired. I feel very like lost. So the last three days, I have been feeling really lost. I seem to forget a lot of things too. So I don't know if that has to do with the pregnancy. Probably it does. Uh, I'm drinking a lot of water. Um, I don't want to get too graphic, but my chest feels heavy. Oh my god. Okay, so my weight for my 16 weeks was 134. I did lose a pound from my um, six, one, from my 15 week to my six, 16, and, but don't worry about it, I picked it all up. <laughs> I am at 137 pounds currently, so that was a big jump, like 4 pounds. Uh, I've been drinking a lot of water, I have been craving, if you saw my Snapchat, um, I don't know if you guys follow me on Snapchat, but... Sometimes like I like to snap a lot. Sometimes I don't. Sometimes I, I come and go. But yesterday I my cravings were green olives with tahini on top. Oh my god, it just tastes so yummy. I ate that yesterday and then it knocked me out and then I I took it like a two hour nap. And it was so cute because Diego went and put a blanket on me and then they're just watching TV while I take a nap. Another thing that I have noticed on my 17 week at the beginning of my 17 week. Since I'm already pretty much putting, what, 17 pounds on, um, I noticed that my belly is starting to feel like it's stretching. So I did buy this cream for um, stretch marks. I got it at Target. Um, 
It's cocoa butter formula with vitamin E, so hopefully it works. I used this on um, Rosa and Diego when I was pregnant with them. So I'm starting to apply this at night. It is very uncomfortable at night to sleep. I think I have mentioned that to you guys. But now, officially, I have to sleep on my side. I use the restroom a lot at night. I don't know if that's too much information, but <laughs> but I, it's happening. Um, my feet are getting swollen. Uh, it comes and goes. It comes and goes. I went shopping for maternity clothes. So this is a maternity dress. This is my dress. It's very cute. Uh, very comfortable. Um, for me, I am a breastfeeding person. So I have breastfed my kids. And that's something that I'm going to do. No questions asked. Uh, it's a must. So yeah, I am going to be breastfeeding my baby. And I'm excited about that. Very excited. Super convenient. Super easy, natural, the best. I don't. I mean, if you have the time, of course. If you're, um, if you're because of work and all that stuff, and you can't do that as a new mommy, I understand. I completely understand. But if you can, my advice to you mothers to be is to try to breastfeed, even if you're not producing any milk. Give it a try. Don't give up because trust me, you will get the milk. <laughs> me, like when Rosa was born, it was no question. Like when they asked me, are you going to breastfeed? No, yes, I am breastfeeding because I want to make sure my child has the best. Um, it's going to build their immune system. It's just the best. So yes, I am going to breastfeed. <laughs> and my mom did get me like a cream for, um, for that because if, well, I mean, if you are a first time mother, you're going to know that if you're gonna breastfeed, it's gonna be very painful. Um, it's gonna be it's 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 hard work, <laughs> but your breast will get used to it because sometimes it does crack and it bleeds and it burns and oh, trust me, it's no fun. But like I said, it's all for our babies that we're doing this. So yes, I would recommend you guys to breastfeed. If you guys want me to do a video for those time um, first time mommies. I kind of want to do a video for you guys just like explaining what to expect because I know when I was a first time mom, I was just, I didn't know what to expect. But as you guys know, I'm on my third one. So I kind of know what to expect. <laughs> well, not to the fullest because I don't remember. But I kind of have a better idea of what, what's going to happen or what's coming ahead of me. So I want to give you guys like um, a few tips and advice on... What is coming for you guys? Um, I want to tell you guys my baby's gender on my next video. I hope you guys don't mind. I really don't know how to like tell you guys or how to surprise you. So I might just like tell you <laughs> in a video or maybe make a surprise. But I'm still thinking about it. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it. When I'm laying down at night, I can like now feel that my uterus is all the way like up here. Like I can feel it because I'm like laying down and I can assume in my stomach. And I can just feel it. Um, it is exciting. I'm very excited. I'm scared. And like I said before, I can't believe I'm pregnant. I. It sounds very silly, but I really can't believe I'm pregnant. Like, I see myself. I see old pictures of me. And I'm like, wow, I'm at my third child. Like, that is crazy. Like, wow. I know that's one of the things that I wanted for this year. Like, I, I remember on my vision board, I wrote having a baby by December <laughs> of 2016 and we're literally gonna have a baby by December. I don't know if it happens to you guys, my pregnant subbies, but I have been having very vivid dreams, which they can be very scary. I've been very paranoia um, about my kids. Like I said, I don't know if it has to do with all the things that I have seen on social media. Also, I want to share with you guys, I did open a Facebook, a new Facebook, and I will put the link um, down below as well. This is going to be a public Facebook because somebody asked me if I had a Facebook, and the answer is yes, I do. I actually have a Facebook um, but under Leslie Joanna. I also have an Instagram under Leslie Joanna, which is kind of like my personal then I have my makeup by Les, which is more of a, my befores and afters, my clients. Um, it's more dedicated to, dedicated to my clients. If you guys, you guys are welcome to uh, follow my Instagram and like my Facebook. If you guys like, I'm gonna on my Facebook since I literally just opened it like two days ago. I'm gonna be sharing a lot of pictures, a lot of. Um, I'm gonna be more active there, like on the daily. <laughs> And I can just share with you guys things that I want to share about my kids, me, what I what I got, or new sales, anything. So 
please make sure to like my Facebook page um, if you want to like follow me and see me more on the daily <laughs> and uh, yeah so that's if you want to you don't have to and also on my snapshot as you guys know if you follow my snapshot most of the mornings I let you know what I'm cooking for the kids because every morning I have to cook I mean every day I have to cook like three times a day so at times I'm like oh my god I want to make a video but I can because I have to like cook and clean and do all that but luckily today my mom took Rosa and Diego to her house so that gave me a break and it gave me time for me to record for you guys and make two videos instead of one um, so yeah I'm excited so thank you mommy <laughs> thank you mommy for taking care of Rosa and Diego right now um, so yeah so that is pretty much it you guys uh, I'm trying to think what else has been new I'm also getting a PO box uh, and I will let you guys know all the information so in case you guys want to send me anything for the baby anything to review anything just feel free to send me or any letters whatever you guys want to send me anyways I think that is it for today um I hope you guys enjoy this week I mean <laughs> I'm telling you I can't even talk I hope you guys enjoy this um, video I hope you have I hope you guys have a wonderful week. I will see you guys on my next one. On my 18th week, I will let you guys know what I'm having. I'm so excited. And I'm going to do a mini haul of all the things that I have got for the baby. Anyways, I love you guys so much. Kisses. Thank you for watching. And I will see you on my next video. I am going to play with you. It needs to get fixed, though. Yeah, all you need to do is what Gabby said. See? Look mm -hmm. it. Come here. Come here. Look it. I see. You can't do it. Yeah, yeah, she can. Yes, yeah, she can. Junior, why do you always say can't? Don't listen to him. Tingle. My ball's down I there. Do it's gone now. I Look how pretty we are. I love it. Ready for the fireworks. Yeah, those avocados weren't ready. And this is the view. We'll bring the tortillas from the house. Por favor. Yay. Por favor. We're watching <laughs> the sunset. Do you? He has a good imaginary. imaginary. Are you guys enjoying it? It's a fun thing. <laughs> Yeah, a little bit to the right. Diego, get back. Diego, get back. We're gonna surprise my mom for her birthday. Do you happy birthday to you? Happy birthday. Not instead to take a picture with the kids. With the kids. Happy birthday! Gabby, yeah, can you take a picture? Mommy? Okay, can you take a picture? <laughs> this is usually for us, but it's for you. Uh -huh. This time. She feels great. Bye bye. 
I'm hungry, so it's just checking. Um, lightning strikes every time. Thanks for watching. I will see you on my next video. Bye. And everybody's watching her, but she's looking at you.